Yo, what is up everyone, Dustin Dew here. If you still don't know about it, I have my one-on-one -on -one GeoGuessr coaching service, link in description, check it out. Let's get on with the video. Alright, so this video is about 5 must-know websites that you must know for GeoGuessr that will improve your experience 100%. So website number one is Map Generator. What this website can do is let's suppose you select a country. You can select the number of locations you want to generate randomly using this website. You can also do a lot of custom stuff like rejecting unofficial, rejecting Gen 1. Even you can find unofficial coverage if you want. You can also press press find tracker coverage if you want to find specific trackers for certain countries. Like for India, there used to be like full tracker coverage. So if I press find tracker coverage and I press start, it will just show me all the trackers and it will not load any official coverage for me. And yeah, as you can see here, the locations are coming in, they're loading. You can erase your markers to improve the performance, otherwise it becomes like slow and stuff. But uh, yeah, this is it for the first website. I will link all the websites in the description if you want to check them out. Alright, website number two <clears throat> is everybody's favorite, it's Plonkit. Um, Plonkit is the number one place for world records, basically the only viable place for world records right now. If you go to the record sections and the main records, you can see all of them here on its these are on only the streak ones and if you want to see my record it should be somewhere here there it is so that's that um you can also see some high school records which is on diverse worlds community world yeah basically these two different modes um you have the competitive standings which you can um play in the plonk at the score. i will link that in the description as well you can also have access to a bunch of Tampa Monkey scripts that you can use. Even these these are some websites as well which you can use and are very very helpful. You can have most of the important ones. You can have them in here. Very very epic stuff that they compiled it all together. And the main attraction of this website for me at least would be the guide. So they are constantly adding countries to this guide and all of them have three sections. First is identifying the country Second is the regional and specific clues and Spotlight has like specific road or like area um, clues and stuff. So you can also see what the, what the percentage of camera generations is, the domain, the driving side, the flag. So yeah, this is, this is very epic stuff. And now there's regional state specific clues like that. There's some miscellaneous stuff and then there's Spotlight. So you have Christmas Island, Cocos Island. This one particular um, Tom Price place looks like this. Alice Springs look like, looks like this, so very helpful things overall. So yeah, I would 100% recommending, 100% recommend checking this website out. On to website number three. This is actually Rihanna's map maker. I will link this down below as well. This is basically the GeoGuessr map maker, but like a hundred times better. Like it can do everything you could ever want, and it's still better than the GeoGuessr map maker. Like if I go and create a map, let's say test, okay create it let's say i go into russia and i'll put that down i'll put that down put that down and then let's say i want to put some locations in asian russia so not only do you see the exact place where you're putting your location you're also seeing when it was captured which is helpful obviously and the best thing that i love about this map maker as the polygons so what you can do anyway we'll we'll try it here to make a polygon now i covered all these locations the best thing about this is i can bulk add a tag so i can name it asian russia and done boom so now these locations are called asian russia and that does the job speaking of importing and exporting you can import files from here you can export files from here it's very nice very simple and yeah, 100% worth checking out. Website number four, uh, the fan favorite, GeoHints. For, um, I would say this is very helpful for all beginners and all intermediate players. You can see a load of things like architecture, bollards, companies, and currency, flags, follow cars, Google cars, house numbers. There's so much stuff to check out. So yeah, if you're a beginner and if you're ever confused as to what bollard is in which country or what house number is in which country, this is your place to go. And last but not the least, I haven't seen a lot of people talk about this, but this one is called iStreetView. 
So it's nothing out of the ordinary. It's basically, you can directly load Street View instead of having to go into Google Maps and then change it to Street View and that kind of stuff. You can just click anywhere and then uh, load the Street View for that. Like, let's say I press random Street View, so it just puts me in Brazil. The good thing about this app is that you can firstly download this 360 picture onto your device. You, you could, if you want to do that for some reason, you can do that. Also, you have the Pano ID here. Pano IDs are very, very important um, when it comes to like map making stuff. Um, so yeah, I just thought this was a cool one that not many people knew about. So I thought it would be worth sharing and yeah, that is it. So that is it for today's video. Hope you enjoyed. Hope you learned something new, I guess. Um, all the websites are linked down below. The Plonker Discord is down below. Thanks for watching. See you. Bye-bye.